Beauty, Beauty come across on the outside. Absolutely flies round that first corner. It's deafening sound in the stadium. Beauty absolutely rocketed out of the and Beauty's gonna win in a canter almost the half the length of the strike. With all the hard work in the first corner. Crowd on their feet. Uh, just to get across the whole field. And he had so much momentum through the corner and as you say, he had a 30-yard lead coming out of turn two on the opening lap, and that itself, it, it was over, really, and truthfully, barring mechanical issues, it was all over from then on, and he just stretched that lead further and further away. And then... Second ride for these guys, and we're underway. Newly's made a nice start off that inside gate. They charge into the first turn, and the other three riders have disappeared off to the safe defence, and Beauty is cleared off once again. Bit of water on the track. Here comes Janowski around the outside of Jack Holder. Holder now slipping back in. But he is looking superb out front. Sensational ride once again from Graham Beauty. Bands on their feet. Spike time. All he wants to do is ride his bike. And just look at that start he makes. The bike doesn't lift, just goes forwards. Everybody else goes across the track. The water's... Green light is on. Oh, Sapelski moved there on the inside. The Beauty's made an absolute hurler out of gate number three. Ideal. Ooh. Oh, hang on to it. Lifted violently, we got away with that. Leon Madsen coming through, very circumspect in second place. Dan Bewley now is going to wind it on. So he's got staying safe at the moment, but I've got to say, don't want to put the commentator's curse on him, but Dan Bewley doing all the right things, just riding around in the dirt line, the most consistent part of the track, not so many holes out there. And he's done what he's had to do. Dan Bewley finishing on 12 points, smashing effort from him. It's time. Yeah, two of the biggest races of his life coming up. Uh, hopefully, if he can make his way to the final, but he's so smooth there. That his only mistake on the first turn there, just a rut that just uh, looks like Jason Doyle has caught several times. Like once again, we see a bike with both wheels off the ground. That's not a nice situation to be in riding one of these things. But uh, he rode the bike very, very sensibly. Now, of course, in a semi-final. Takes her up from her underway. Julie's made a great start out of gate number two. Fires himself to the front. Roars down the first corner. Sparsling it out into second place with Dudek slipping back into third. Madsen didn't make it from the outside gate. And Julie Sparsling, the championship leader. That's no bad result for him. One last big effort for Julie down the back straight. Here he comes. Listen to the crowd. Take him home. This is a moment he will never forget. Absolutely right. Stunning performance.